Hello everyone, Dr. Perlmutter here. A really interesting article just appeared in uh, Men's Health, uh, the online version, menshealth.com, and it is entitled, The Benefits of Probiotics Are Well Documented, But Can They Improve Mental Health? And I think this is a really timely article uh, because first, it went into great depth uh, in terms of reviewing the connection between the gut and the brain how that is mediated to some degree the in a relationship by not only uh, the vagus nerve that connects the two but more importantly the bacteria that live in the gut and the various metabolic products that they produce how those metabolic products affect the brain uh, i was interviewed for this uh, uh, article as well as dr emran meyer you know we've talked to him on the empowering neurologist before and I really, again, believe it was a very good overview. You'll see a link to the article uh, accompanying this video. Uh, what they concluded, I think, was really very important. That first, there is this powerful relationship. Uh, we've known that for a while. Uh, that uh, depression, for example, is primarily an inflammatory disorder. We recognize that inflammation, for the most part, has its genesis within the gut. They really did also conclude uh, that we're not yet at a stage where we can uh, talk about treating mental illness uh, with probiotics alone. And I would agree with that. They did, however, quote research uh, that indicated that intervention using certain types of probiotic species uh, has been proven effective, for example, in altering the mood uh, in humans. And I think we're clearly at the very beginning of that research, but it is very, very exciting because we are seeing results. So I would offer up uh, the advice to read this really intriguing and well-written uh, article, again, in Men's Health. Um, there's a lot to be said about caring for your microbiome. I think that's one of the areas they quoted me about was the idea that the foods we eat, for example, are really relevant in terms of keeping the gut bacteria healthy. Uh, it is the focus of what we wrote about in the book uh, Brain Maker. And I wanted to share other news with you that BrainMaker is now in uh, Brazilian Portuguese. I just got this uh, yesterday and also now uh, in Russian. So uh, it's good. It's good that we're getting the message out now in over 30 languages around the world that our lifestyle choices are really very important for us, not only uh, because of their direct effects that have been studied for a long time, but for uh, their effects on how they, uh, our lifestyle choices affect our gut bacteria, and then secondarily, the important role of our gut bacteria in terms of our health. So looking at our stress levels, our exercise, our sleep patterns, and perhaps most importantly, the foods that we choose to eat through the lens of how these choices affect our gut bacteria and their health, I think is very, very important. So more news to come, that's for sure. Thanks for joining me. I'm Dr. David Perlmutter.